everybody. I wanted to share with you um, very quickly a giveaway that I won from Wenka who is finally crafting on YouTube. I'm going to put her link to her channel below. She, I, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's an ongoing giveaway, but I could be wrong, but it's been some time since I entered it. Um, it was a use and renew um, giveaway where, you know, you would send items to her that she was in need of and then your, your name would go into a drawing. So um, this month she drew my name, so I thought I'd just share with you guys really, really quickly and I'll cover the address. Um, first of all, I love the stamps, so I'm super excited about that. I'm going to cut those out because it's always so fun when you get um, stamps from different countries. So, you know, as a crafter and a junk journaler, we love anything like that. So this is the package that um, Winka sent me, and I am just delighted um, to have been the winner of this. It's, it's just amazing. I feel like it's Christmas here, and um, let me just see if I can get everything out in one, one, oh, I may not be able to, okay. I've read the card and had a quick look through, but I wanted to come on here and go through it with all of you so you can see. So let me just see if I can get all this out. And then we'll start going through it. Okay. Oh, awesome. First of all, I've got some napkins. Those are beautiful. Love the coloring on that. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Thank you, Wonka. Oh, that's very unusual. Now, I don't have anything like this, so that's really cool. Oh my goodness, I love that. Now that's beautiful. Very unusual to see a black background like that. That's gorgeous. I'll definitely be using those. Oh, that's pretty. Very pretty. I will be using that. Definitely. Beautiful stamp. Little punch. Oh, look at little four-leaf clover. That is so sweet. Thank you, Wanka. Gosh, I didn't expect you to send this much. Oh, I love the little box. Oh, I'll have to I'll have to keep that and use that for some of my little fussy cuts. That's sweet. <laughs> little um it's like a chalkboard type wood label, so that I can definitely use that in my crafting space. That's pretty. Beautiful little vine border. That I can certainly use because I'm always looking for little things. <clears throat> Sometimes in the journals you don't want a really big, bold um, stamp and this is going to just be beautiful along the edge. So thank you so much for that. And these are gorgeous. She knows um, I love this kind of thing because I can certainly make use of all of this. Beautiful. How exciting to get something from, um, she's in Norway, and it's one of the countries I really, it's on my, you know, top ten places. Well, to be honest, it's it's in the top five places I would love to visit. Um, oh, these are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I may have to ask her where she got those, because those are, um, you know, die cuts that love that. Some tickets, we can always use those. So she's in Norway, and as I was saying, I, oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful, Winka. Um, it's one of the countries I would love to visit. I can't imagine what it must be like to wake up there every morning with those views. Oh, look at these lovely ladies. Oh, Wenka, you have sent so many beautiful things. Thank you so, so much. Oh, look at that. 
Oh, that's a tilde. Yeah, I've never had anything. Um, oh gosh, these are going to be treasured because I've never re been able to get my hands on anything tilde. Oh, look at, I think, I reckon all of this is, wow, beautiful. That's, that's really nice, too. That feels like a Project Life card, but I love those. I can definitely make use of those. Wow. Very unusual. This, this is what's so fun about this kind of thing is because, you know, she's clearly picked up items that I couldn't get my hands on, and hopefully, you know, I think from her response, I think she got some items that she had been wanting, and, um, and couldn't get a hold of. Aren't he so fun? Oh, look at her expression. I bet you this is all Tilda. Beautiful. Absolutely. Oh, boy. And, you know, I just, it's so difficult to get your hands on anything like that. Um, so, thank you so, so much. Look at these. Even the tiny little die cuts there. Just so sweet. She had, um, when I first found her channel, she had just done some little mini um, journals. Look at those tiny, aren't they beautiful? Those little die cuts. She had just done some little journals that she had taken some of the tilde paper and I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think she had laminated them to, into little bitty uh, planner type journals, and they were just so sweet. And um, I, I really hoped at some point her and I could do a swap, but you know, life's just so busy for for both of us. It just hasn't worked out. But she, she that's what I originally found her was her little journals. They were just beautiful. Gosh, these are nice. Thank you so much, Monica. You didn't need to send this much, but it is definitely appreciated and will be used. <laughs> That's the ribbon that she had that tied up with. Oh, awesome! Some tea. Oh, I look forward to trying And look, it's, it looks like it's an iced tea, which is very... Mm, I think iced tea, maybe in Europe, is a bit more common than the UK, but it's starting to get here. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Although, you guys think I'm crazy. I bring my tea bags from the U.S. I always get, you know, the family size so I can make my tea. <laughs> but that, I'm, I'm looking forward to trying that because that's a fruit flavored. So I'm excited about that, too. I love my iced tea. You can't be from the South and not like iced tea. That's beautiful. Ooh, that may have to go on my um, nightstand because that is a beautiful. I wonder if she made that. Ooh, I'll have to find out from her. Oh, wow. Look at that piece. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. That's all been, uh, I think that's cross stitch, isn't it? That's beautiful. I'll definitely find a use for that. That's very pretty. That must be so old. Wow. Thank you, Monica. Those are gorgeous. I love anything like this because it just, the fact that somebody took the time to make these and and that person probably had so much pride in, um, you know, what they've created. And I, it just, I don't know, there's something about it I really, really like. That's beautiful. Very, very pretty. Oh, look at that. Now that fabric is definitely me. I love that, totally. Because I'm trying to decorate my house. Oh, well, it's just a mix, mismatch, I'll be honest. But I love farm, the farm theme. And I love cows. I don't know if I told you guys, but cows, I'm really... I, what started me was the Scottish, um, the Highland cows with the big... Well, I'll show you a picture. My friend, 
One of my friends here had this put over. She was up in Scotland and she took a photo of this cow and she had it made into a canvas for me for Christmas. This is what I fell in love with and now it's just it's just run over to cows, period. And particularly now that we're getting involved in, you know, the raw milk and, um, you know, just becoming much more aware about our food supply. The cows have just taken over my whole um, crafting room. But that, um, that fabric... I love it. I think this may have to be on a journal for me. Because I've been wanting to do another one. Um, I think I'm going to try, if I can at all, make myself one with that. Because that is just, that's that's me right there. Love it. Absolutely. And I'm betting this is probably going back 80s. Because if you're of my time age, you know, around the age of me, in the 80s, do you remember, everything was decorated and it was cranberry and like a hunter green. And you'd get, because I had my kitchen at that time, you know, I love apples as well. And I had my kitchen done in um, an apple theme with the wallpaper. <laughs> so it was the plaid uh, wallpaper and then the border had all the apples and then the green in the background. You know, that was totally 80s, so I reckon that fabric is, is going back. And apparently, everybody's class in 80s as vintage now, so if that doesn't make you feel old, so yeah, you're welcome. You, you're welcome for that. <laughs> Nothing like uh, make it, starting your day off feeling good about things. We're vintage now. <laughs> But um, thank you, Wanka. That is just such a nice little package to receive, and I appreciate it. It will all be used. I can promise you that. She's such a sweet, sweet woman. But you guys check out her channel, and um, I'm going to get all these put away in the proper place so I can get to those and use them. But check out her channel, and I will be back very soon. I hope you guys are having a good week so far. And I'll see you here soon. Bye.